this is another message apart from the astrology the message of the astrology this is another message that the lord gave to me concerning uh, september 21 and 23 2017 and also about august 21 he said i should pass this message to the church so that they would never never be moved god told me that this is not the end of the world that it is never the day of rapture that nobody can predict the rapture nobody can use what is happening in the atmosphere or what is happening in the among the heavenly bodies to predict the coming of the lord nobody knows when jesus christ is going to return matthew chapter 24 verse 36 makes it very clear that but of the day and the hour no man knows even the angels in heaven don't even know but the father alone knows the day the hour that the son of man is going to return so we should not be moved we should not be disturbed that the coming of the lord is is slated for uh, september 21 or 23 no 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 that is not scriptural the bible says that nobody knows when the lord is going to come back never never be moved by what we are seeing today and what we are about seeing we should never never be moved because these are the things that the bible tells us that are going to happen there are two major things that we need to learn from what we are seeing today and what we are going to see from this moment especially august 21 uh, september 21 and 23rd the things that we are going to see we should learn from them and these are the two major things i want us to learn from them number one because the bible has rightly predicted that these things are going to happen we should believe that the bible is true and that the word of god will never fall to the ground it is better for heaven and earth to pass away than for the word of god to pass away and not and also not come to fulfillment then also we christians who believe that jesus christ is going to come again we have to sit up we have to watch and pray and watch and pray and watch and pray that is our job we are never to be carried away nor even to become afraid by what is happening today we know this is the very end of time we should not be carried away by miracles we should not be carried away by the worldly uh, pressure that is upon humanity that is about draining away all the godliness in humans and replace it with worldliness we should be watchful and know that jesus christ is going to come any moment from now we are not permitted to set dates when the lord will come but we are advised to watch for these signs and whenever we see these signs we should trim our lamps very well fill our lamps with oil like the wise like the five white virgins we are to do that if we don't do that we will fail i tell you some people say there is no rapture but there is rapture i have seen it in my dreams i have the conviction that the lord is going to come again i want to encourage you to worship god in spirit and in truth because the whole of this world will pass away but our souls and the word of god will never pass away because these two things are eternal god is eternal and we are eternal beings you should choose where you are going to spend your eternity either in the lake of fire which i advise you never to go or in the presence of god where there is bliss where there is joy where there is everything called good i want to encourage you to step up your faith and walk even as we wait for the coming of the lord thank you god bless you i want you to visit our website www.egoiopener.com if you have any question you can use the email on your screen email us and we will respond to you thank you and god bless you don't forget to subscribe because there are many messages that are coming i have another youtube channel which i want you to subscribe to there to post things specifically about sexual purity godly sexuality the the channel name the youtube channel name is biblical sexual purity we have a facebook page make sure you like it subscribe and follow us thank you god bless you bye bye